A lawsuit filed by six states, including Iowa, Nebraska, aiming to block President Biden's plan to cancel hundreds of billions of dollars in student loan is moving forward. Based on that lawsuit, the St. Louis-based 8th U.S. Circuit Court of Appeals issued an injunction today, thereby barring the U.S. Department of Education from erasing student loan debt based on Biden's executive order in August. Now, this preliminary injunction halts the program while an appeal plays out. The court put administrative stays temporarily blocking that program out on October 21st. This is while it considered the state's motion that came one day after a federal judge allowed the program to proceed. The three-judge St. Louis panel says on Monday today their order would remain in effect until further notice by the Eighth Circuit or the U.S. Supreme Court. Nebraska Attorney General Doug Peterson released a statement in response to that ruling. It says in part that the court ruling, quote, recognizes that the attempt to forgive over $400 billion in student loans threatens serious harm to the economy that cannot be undone. It is important to stop the Biden administration from such unlawful abuse of power. Now, this all comes days after a federal judge in Texas blocked the program, saying that it usurped Congress's power to make laws. The administration appealed the Texas case and is likely to appeal today's ruling by the Eighth Circuit Court of Appeals as well.